The Albinism Society of Kenya has filed a court petition seeking to revert what they say is inflated procurement of sunscreen lotions and a shambolic census exercise by the National Council for Persons with Disabilities, which they said was not publicized in good time and manner. Uh, the National Council, through Phoebe Nyagudi, the director, and we must mention her in particular because she's the one in charge of the process, um, has gone ahead and uh, procured, in this contract between themselves and Suken, 19,500 bottles. Um, so we are asking, really, uh, we went to the streets to demand that we be included in government programming. But ours was not to come and enrich a few individuals. This is a genuine case. It's, about, uh, it's a matter of life and death. And yet we have individuals who want to think that will take advantage of such something that is in motion. The National Coordinator for Albinism Society of Kenya, Isaac Maura, said that the money they had demanded for the sunscreen lotions was not properly and accounted for by the National Council for Persons with Disabilities. In addition, the price of the sunscreen in the local market is way beyond the reach of many persons living with albinism. This, he says, contravenes Article 33 of the Constitution, which provides that all products should be made available in real market rates. We feel that uh, we are told as members to go and register uh, the nearest district social development office. Ladies and gentlemen, you know very well there is no unit, administrative units currently called district. <laughs> we only have the national and county government. So I don't know where our members are supposed to go. And uh, yet we had advised earlier on that it be done at the chief's level, at the, uh, at the village level, and also with the involvement of persons with albinism, because as you may have seen in the media, people are even running away because they cannot trust the exercise. He noted with concern that some of the members have been affected by skin cancer, which is common among persons with albinism. Therefore, the product should be made available to them pronto. The condition of albinism, the skin type is classified as a subtype of skin type 1. These are people who have the lowest uh, uh, levels of melanin in their body, little or no melanin. And uh, many of our members have succumbed to skin cancer. Some of them who are here, like, uh, where is Ma Maurice? Maurice? The members are still demanding that the National Assembly formulates an act of parliament for persons with albinism. <laughs> Diana Bogwa, GBS News.